hello everyone for today's video it is obviously valentine's day theme so i'm gonna show you how to make these you know a little chocolate hearts why go out and buy some when you can make your own they actually came out pretty darn cute so what are you gonna need are some valentine's day sprinkles any ones you find out there will do i got these two one comes with multi of different ones and the other ones are x and o's some red and pink candy melts and then um it's this is a silicone heart i don't know if you want to call it a baking sheet i forgot what it's called but all i know it's silicone heart baking sheet whatever you want to call it but one of those and then now we're going to take our candy melts and then we're going to melt them in bowls obviously in the microwave how else would you melt it or if you want to do it in the oven whichever you prefer but i melted these in the microwave 30 second intervals obviously mixing in between each um interval Alrighty, so once the chocolate is all nice and melted, you can just go ahead and fill up the hearts in the tray. Um, you can do how many of the colors of each color you want. You can do, I did, it was three rows of pink and three rows of red. Um, you can obviously do, like, if you want to switch between the two, you know, go with the flow, however you feel. And then I also shook the... Um, baking sheet or silicone mat whatever you want to call it a little bit so the chocolate goes out and nice and smooth and it's not all like lumpy how it was and then after you just throw some of um the toppings on top the sprinkles you just throw some of those on top and that's it and you just kind of continue until you fill up the whole entire um silicone sheet thing <laughs> Alrighty, so here is our sheet, nice and full, with all the chocolate covered up. The last two rows, I decided not to put toppings on them. No, just in case, have like some without any of the sprinkles, because why not? So once that's said and done, we're just gonna put them in the fridge and let them harden. To be honest, I don't know how long I left them in for, but obviously just keep them in there until they're nice and harden. <laughs> And then ba-bam, there you have it. You have your own chocolate hearts. I love how nice these came out. I wish I realized to put the sprinkles on first and then the chocolate because as you would see that the sprinkles are actually underneath the um, chocolate. See like how it is here, but you know what? It's kind of like a little surprise, but still, I like it. It's cute. But I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time with another video. Bye!